Mr. Alan Murray, dear entrepreneurs, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. On behalf of the 48.3 million people of Yunnan, I would like to extend a warm welcome to all of you to Fortune Global Sustainability Forum 2019. As we all know, Fortune Forum is one of the most prestigious and globally influential forum. The forum, with a focus on the global concern of sustainability and its theme, Green Grows Up, Forging a New Environmental Consensus, fully shows the ideal and responsibility of the organizers and all parties concerned for green and sustainable development. This theme is in line with the new development concept advocated by China, with the positioning of Yunnan, and with the aspirations of people of all ethnic groups living in the Fujian Lake Basin for generations. That Fortune chose Fujian Lake as the venue of this forum fully shows people's confidence and expectation for Yunnan. I believe that this forum will not only deepen people's understanding of China and Yunnan, but also make great impact by pulling wisdom, enhancing consensus, and promoting practices on sustainability. It will also push Yunnan's sustainable development towards higher goals and more practical actions. Yunnan boasts unique advantages in promoting green economy and sustainable development. Here endows magnificent landscapes and admirable weather. The 394,000 square kilometer Yunnan offers you snowy lands and tropical rainforests dotted rivers and lakes, realizing volcanoes and geothermal fields. We have numerous world-renowned historical heritages, including five UNESCO World Heritages, such as the Stone Forest and the ancient town of Lijiang. In addition, Yunnan is a natural oxygen bar with booming flowers all year round, especially in Kunming, city of eternal spring. All of this contributes to the province's diversity in landform, climate, biosphere, ethnicity, and culture. Here sits a sound ecosystem with abundant natural resources. Yunnan is reputed as the kingdom of fauna and flora, kingdom of non-ferrous metals. It boasts a complete and sound ecosystem with over 6% forest coverage. The Fuxian Lake dying ar lying around us is the largest deep freshwater lake in China and one of the lakes with the best water quality in the world. I believe the Belt and Road will definitely bring out the brilliance of this hidden pearl on the ancient Tea Horse Road. Here, prosper inclusive ethnic cultures. Here, one would witness the inclusiveness of our ethnic culture. Such th scenes are re really common in Yunnan. One city connecting three countries, two countries sharing one village, one village developed by eight to nine ethnic minority groups, one family consisting of three to four ethnic minorities. With their own culture characteristics well reserved, Han people and 25 indigenous ethnic minorities live in solidarity and harmony like pomegranate seeds clinging t tightly to each other. These diligent and hospitable people, they live together, work together, and prosper together. Here offer unique location advantages. Being a bridge connecting China and South and Southeast Asia since ancient times, Yunnan is now embracing a broader prospect and greater development momentum as the Belt and Road, the BCIM Economic Corridor, the China Indochina Peninsula International Economic Corridor intersect here. More importantly, to protect their own homeland has been a strong wish shared by the people of all ethnic groups in Yunnan for generations. The idea of building Yunnan into China's most beautiful province in the new era with beautiful landscapes, sound ec ecosystem, clean environment, well-managed cities and villages has gained great popular support and has seen joint and conscious actions made by Yunnan people. 
great achievements have been made in promoting green economy and sustainable development in recent years. As President Xi Jinping instructed that Yunnan should strive to become a model area of ethnic solidarity and progress, a vanguard of ecological conservation, and a powerhouse of China's opening up to South and Southeast Asia, as well as a South Western, a southeastern eco screen for China. We've made great efforts to implement President Xi's development concept of clear waters and lush mountains are as good as mountains of gold and silver. With a focus on integrating economic, social development and environmental protection, we strive to build a modern industry system that is innovative, open, high-end, IT-based and green. We channel great efforts to pursue the three cards development strategy, namely green energy, green food, and healthy lifestyle destination. We also took solid action in three critical battles against potential risk, poverty, and pollution. By doing so, our GDP growth rates have been secured at top three in China in recent years. Poverty incidence dropped from 21.7% in 2012 to 5.39% to date. All poor people would be lifted out of poverty by next year. Hereby, I would like to share two pieces of good news with you. First, the central government just approved the establishment of China Yunnan Pilot Free Trade Zone. Second, the 15th Conference of the Parties to the United Nations Convention on Biological Diversity has also been scheduled to be held in Yunnan next autumn. It's fair to say that Yunnan is presenting a new self to the whole world with its solid actions in promoting green and sustainable development. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, dear friends, promoting green and sustainable development is the common responsibility and the glorious mission of all entrepreneurs present here and that of the, the international community. International cooperation is the only way to achieve this goal. This June, President Xi Jinping delivered a speech at the 23rd plenary session of the St. Petersburg International Economic Forum, explaining the significance of sustainable development. He addressed that sustainable development is the golden key to solving current global problems, and he put forward China's solution to strengthen the international cooperation. We sincerely look forward to sharing the wisdom and opportunities with you to promote practical and win-win cooperation so as to build a community of a shared future for mankind. We sincerely encourage all the entrepreneurs and friends to share the charm of ecology, ethnicity, culture, openness, and development of colorful Yunnan. To conclude, I would like to thank Mr. Alan Murray and Fortune Magazine for their hard work in putting together this forum. I wish the Fortune Global System P Forum 2019 a complete success. I wish the blue sky, warm sunshine, and crystal clear lake of Kalfu Yunnan could ensure all of your presence day. I wish you good health and every success. Thank you.